have to rely on melee to finish this thing off, I think. That's not going to be good. Hi friends, how are you? This is the Call Donut speaking, and welcome back to Eden Star. Uh, it's been a while. I'm sorry about that, guys. I have been busy, but I'm excited to be back. Uh, and today, it looks like we actually do not have a lot of time. This is going to be a weird episode because last episode we actually left off just a little bit before the second night. Uh, we do have some good fortifications set up. We have a nice bottleneck. Uh, we have turrets all over our base. I'm getting a weird glitch where like my screen freezes uh, when I turn too quickly. I don't, I don't know why. Like if I keep turning in the same direction, it's okay, but like switching is weird. I, I don't know what's doing that. Uh, it's a pretty taxing game. The graphics are really cool, so may maybe that's it. I, I really don't know, guys, though, I'll be honest. Uh, we need to kill that hive. Unfortunately, we don't have a whole lot of bullets, uh, so I don't think we can do it. Uh, let's check out our resources. What do we have? Uh, it's not great. We don't have a ton. Uh, I could try to build something quickly. Weapons. Uh, actually, let's, let's do consumables. Uh, micro disruptor cell. Ceruleum. Let's build. Uh, yeah, can I do four? Yeah, that should be fine. Okay, cool. So now we have a ton of ammo. Let's go out and take down this hive real quick. Yeah, we can do this. We can totally do this, guys. We got this. Well, we got a lot of them. Up. Just trying to melee them for now. We are inside our kit right now, so we are okay. And we can rely on the turret to help us out, too. Which is nice. Uh, we can kind of just retreat to this bottleneck and get our turret shooting them. Which is pretty awesome. The turret's just going to wreck these fools. Um. do its work. Okay, come on. Get inside, get oh shoot. Well, that's really bad. Like, really, really, really bad. Um not only did we not kill the hive, we just lost all of our inventory. Uh, we're now out of Tesselinium in the Eaton kit. Crap! Um, this is gonna be a really bad night. That's that's all I have to say, guys. Honestly, this is gonna go really, really, really badly. Also, I built this wall backwards. That's annoying. Uh, that's that's kind of frustrating that these walls are built backwards. It looks really, really weird. I'm gonna have to redo that in the future, but we don't have time. It's night. Great. Uh, crap. I have no gun. I was, like, all set and ready to go, and I was going to murder that hive, and it was going to be awesome, but no. Uh, I have no gun. We're dead. GG. Um, I guess we're turtling for now until we hear the turrets activate. That's that one. Oh, crap. Nothing I can do about that. Okay, so far so good, though. Our positioning is very helpful. Uh, we are just holed up in a cave here. That's helping out a lot. Um, guess we'll do some mining. So we got nothing better to do. I'll have to go kill that hive tomorrow. Uh, get the Tesselinium so we can actually respawn in the future. Because we are in big trouble. As is. Um... Let's see, so, I don't know what we're going to be doing next. Uh, we're obviously going to want to flip these walls because it's going to bother me that they're backwards. But, until we do that, uh, some things... Let's see, how's it doing? Is it okay? Dang, we're wrecking them. Okay. Uh, what's happening? I hear enemies. I'm not seeing any. Okay, I'll take it. That's cool. Uh, what I think we will want to do, probably, is... 
um, get more turrets, so it's really hard to crack our base. Uh, weapons, probably gonna want to get an SMG. Uh, stalkers can shut down the can shut down the turrets, so I gotta be extra careful. About that. What's that guy doing? Do not understand what you're doing. Right? Okay. Get back inside. Yeah, this system is working really well, though. I'm honestly super thrilled about that. I am concerned about uh, the fact that we just lost all of our items. That was really bad. Uh, but we do need to kill that hive, so I don't think it was a bad idea. Uh, just poor execution. Uh, so some things to shoot for early on here are going to be the SMG, because I think that was really powerful last time we played. Um, modules, getting the, uh, the smash ability is going to be huge, regeneration is big, uh, and then the energy blade is going to be another target for us. Um, oh, don't blow up. Okay, this got paralyzed for a second there. Alright, I'm just gonna let that come closer and have the turret shoot it. Let's keep talking about our plans. So, I think the first thing to get is probably Smash. That's probably the most important thing. Although, actually, given our position, we can kind of just turn it. We almost don't even really need Smash. Uh, which, in which case, what we probably want to shoot for is uh, Regeneration. That's probably the best thing. Um, so, Regeneration... Probably after that, we would want um, the Energy Blade, and then maybe the SMG, or um, or possibly the Kinetic Force and Kinetic Laser. But I think the first thing is regeneration, and just getting more tools. Whoa, that hurts. Okay. Uh, we can probably just run out and kill this thing. I mean, what I would really like is for it to run into this bottleneck and get shot into oblivion by our, uh, our turret. Uh, but it is now outside the shield of our Eden kit, so I'm just going to wait 20 seconds. Uh, my immediate objective for this next day is to go get some more materials so we can continue to improve our base and get more upgrades. Uh, because right now we're in a pretty rough spot. Uh, the other objective is to murder that hive, but we can't do that till we have a pistol again. So that might be the biggest thing, is just get some quick iron knights so we can take down that hive. Because that's a serious problem, is that we do not have, um... Whoa, run away! Okay, let's get inside. Uh, there's some more splinter mites coming after us. We'll let the turret handle them. Good? Not quite. But we're doing better. Dang, there's a lot of crap. Okay. Uh, get inside, get inside. Let's turn handle him. Yeah, I'm letting the turret deal with all this stuff. I am in no position. <laughs> handle that many enemies at one time with my limited weaponry. Okay. That is good then. So we've cleared out the base. Pretty solid. Let's get back and now let's go out and get enough materials for a pistol and some other weaponry. Uh, we should be okay. I think... Ooh, we have some enemies going after our pillars. I mean, better that than us, I guess, but... I mean, okay, you can keep shooting things that are, like, completely useless to attack. That's fine by me. Eventually, we could even build out to this level, honestly, uh, and get some protective stuff here. 
We could at some point, right now, I think it's best to stick with our core defenses and just build up our weaponry. Uh, eventually, though, it may make sense for us to upgrade uh, in that in that way as well. We'll see what our eventual strategy is. Uh, have I made any progress towards getting up on top of this ledge? Yes. No. Come on. No, I didn't want to wall run. Okay, fine. I'll go around. The climbing mechanics get a little bit sketchy when uh, the terrain isn't exactly built for it. Because some of this terrain is not blocked out in the way that the, uh, uh, like these ledges are. Some of it's a little bit smoother and it doesn't necessarily, uh, lend itself well towards doing those sorts of things. Anyway, we're gonna get, like, this piece of ironite, get a pistol, shoot that hive, and, uh, maybe try to build, um, what's attacking us? Come on, man. Just die. Run. Okay. We're good. Yeah, but that needed to happen. We did have to kill that guy. Uh, that is something I didn't think about when I placed those pillars, is that we are going to be in a little bit of trouble. Um, because that's going to have them target it. It is a nice way to exploit the AI, uh, actually. So if we do ever build out and do that second layer of defense, I probably am going to go ahead and use that, because that is pretty cool, actually, that I can just get them to hone in on those pillars and not actually do anything. In fact, I might even do that with our current problem, Max. Who knows? Because uh, it is pretty darn powerful when you think about it. But, uh, the immediate priority is to kill that hive next to our base, because as long as that is there, it is going to be pretty impossible to survive uh, where we are. So, we are going to spend the bulk of our time today on that, and I'm definitely going to keep this episode under 20 minutes, unlike the last one. Uh, just because it's kind of getting late for me, I need to get this video done for you guys so that I can get it out to you. Um, and also, of course, we do want to keep these videos shorter because you guys generally said you would prefer something uh, in that range based on the YouTube poll that I did before. So, anyway, let's get a little bit of this ceruleum so we can build some ammo. Alright. And good enough for me. Okay. I'm satisfied. Let's get back to base. And let's just start building some upgrades. Um, because we really need to ramp up our weaponry. And I think now we probably have good enough resources to do it. So that's cool. Let's get inside here. Oh, we do have some Bridgmanite. I'm going to redo this wall. This wall bothers me. So does this one. Okay. I, I, I have to redo this, guys. I'm sorry. Like, I, I, I can't stand. Um, change category. Yeah, I, I can't stand. Um, no, primitives, that's what we want. Okay. I really cannot stand uh, having this wall set up the way it is. Uh, it's really annoying. Uh, scroll material to Bridgmanite. Is that the right way? Yes, it is. Okay. Fantastic. That's what I wanted. And then this wall is the right way, so that wall that is facing the wrong way. Okay. So we're going to reclaim those materials and place it. Okay, excellent. So we got the walls rearranged. Now we are going to exit build mode and we're going to go into the construction menu. We're going to build a pistol because it's the cheapest one by far. It costs 25? Seriously? Okay, we're going to go get more ceruleum apparently. Uh, change plans. We'll do that real quick. And then we're going to go right back. We're going to get we're going to make this pistol and then we're going to go kill that hive. Uh, but we're making good progress. We're surviving. Uh, that was a huge setback dying because we had just gathered a lot of resources the previous day. Uh, but fortunately, our defenses are set up well enough that we can probably survive for quite a while. Uh, what am I doing? I need ceruleum. Uh, that's enough for a gun, but it's not enough for ammo. Okay, that's not enough for ammo. I have to keep going. Keep searching. Let's go. Um... Ceruleum, ceruleum, ceruleum. I need a ceruleum rock. And I don't see one. Um, 
It's 2%. I'll give it a shot. Okay, that's enough for one ammo pack, but that's not as much as we need. We need more than that. Once I get to 29 Cerulean, we can stop, guys, for your reference. Uh, because that's enough to do two sets of ammo, because they take two Cerulean each. And uh, 25 for the pistol as well, so... I w again, I would really prefer to be not spending our uh, Cerulean on a pistol, but we need something right now because we have to destroy this hive. Uh, it's really non-negotiable at this point. We have to take it down. It's too big a problem, so... Okay, we're good. Let's get back, kill this hive. And unfortunately, I think that's probably going to have to be it for today. Uh, I would like to be doing more this episode. But uh, that's just kind of the way it went today. Uh, it wasn't uh, our best day lately. But it's a slow progress in, uh, progression system right at the beginning. Uh, but I am super excited, actually, to see some of the new stuff that they're bringing out. There are new enemies coming soon. And then also, uh, there's going to be the whole inventory system, which is awesome, because we really don't have uh, inventory right now. Did that craft? Did it Did it craft? Um, yes, it did. Okay, great. Uh, we're going to do two of these, and we're going to create it. Okay. And I have a gun. Okay, excellent. That's what we wanted. The hive regenerated. That's unfortunate. Okay. Let's keep an eye on the splinter mites. They are coming. Alright, save me. I'm counting on you. Gotta be careful with this ammo. Whoa, why, why, why am I taking so much damage? Wh what is happening with these explosions? I don't get it. Uh, hang on. Okay, shield regenerate. Yeah, let's just let the auto turret do some work for us here. Uh, that's probably the best option. Okay. Are we good? Am I, am I good now? Good? Okay, we're pretty much healed up. Oh, get inside, get inside. Let the turret kill the rest of these enemies. Another thing I could look into is, um, there are these fortifications that are new. Uh, what does this look like? So, wall fortification, what does this do? So, has that done something? I, I don't understand what this is. Oh, that's what it is. Okay, I get it. That's cool. I like that. Okay, we're going to do this while the turret kills these enemies. Uh, we're going to fortify our walls, because that's awesome looking. Uh, like, that. that is really cool. I like that a lot. Um, yeah, doorway fortification is what we want. Okay, so that is awesome. We are now totally killing it in terms of defense. Our base is great. Uh, I love that. That's really cool. Um... These enemies are totally bugging out, and I don't know why. Uh, get inside, because they blow up, I think, right? Yeah, they turn into, like, landmines when they die, I think. That's really weird. Okay, you're going to come in and die. Blow up. Okay, everybody's dead. Cool. Are you blowing up, guys? Yes, you are. And I'm taking a lot of damage because of it. That's great. Okay. So they kind of turn into landmines. That's interesting. Did not know that about these guys. Do I have a full ammo clip? Yes, I do. Okay. Shoot it. Keep shooting it. Keep shooting it. Okay, now I have to get inside. I'm not in. Okay. I like the fortification system, though. That's pretty cool, actually. Um, did you kill them? That is something I did not know about these guys, though, is that they're like landmines when they get murdered. Did not know that was part of their behavior. Okay, you blow up. Can I trigger it? I, I, I don't want to, like, die. So... Oh, it's like all those little spikes are individual mines, so that's how you can detect it. I think that's part of the reason why I've died so many times, because I didn't know about that mechanic. Get inside. Get 
side. And then I... Do I have enough anything to craft more ammo? No, okay. Uh, we're gonna have to rely on... We're gonna have to rely on melee to finish this thing off, I think. That's not gonna be good. Uh, but we can probably handle it. Explode, please. Explode. Good. Okay. You two could, like, you know... Run towards me, please. That that would be cool. That. Um, blow up. Nice. Okay. Uh, I think I got to mail it. All right, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. This is dangerous. This is really bad idea. Really, really bad idea. Come on, kill it. All right, get out. Get out. Okay, we did some damage. Now lure him back in. It's so close to dead. It's so close to dead. Oh my gosh. Okay. Alright, let the auto turret smash him. Okay. Oh yeah, another thing, guys. Just let me know if the game sounds are still... Um, are still too high. I've turned them down a little bit since, uh, or I did last episode, and they're still lower this episode, but if they're still too high, tell me, because I would really appreciate that feedback, because I don't know right away, as I'm making the video here, if it is too loud. Uh, so, obviously, just letting me know about that helps a lot. Uh, so, please do leave me feedback. Anyway, we're going to be able to take down this hive, which is fantastic. Um, I'm really happy that we fortified our base. And we didn't die. Well, we did die. But we didn't die, like, permanently, so that was good. Okay, blow up everything. This is a mechanic I did not even realize was a thing before. It's actually really strong. Get the Tesselinium, get the Tesselinium. Did I only get one? Crap. Okay, die, Splinter Knight. Really? That was all of it? That was all the Tesselinium. Well, I mean, I guess it's worth removing the Hive, although we have another one to target next episode. And another one. There are a lot nearby. Fortunately, I guess at the very least, um... That threat is gone. We need more Tesselinium to respawn, I believe. However, I will take, you know, not being dead. That, that's something. Uh, not being dead, having a gun, and not having a hive right next to us. Those are all good things. Uh, let's, let's store our Ironite for now. Store. Yeah, we're going to store our resources for the time being. Uh, anyway, guys... That's about all the time we've got for today. I hope you have enjoyed. Please remember to like and subscribe if you did. This has been Lee Call Donut speaking. Goodbye, friends, and I will see you all next time with some more Eden Star.